Hete Poo. Peace and blessings to all from Divine Peace Meditation and Yoga. This is Baba Seku and Mama Imani on the front stoop. Peace and blessings, y'all. Good morning. I hope y'all having a good one. All right. This is Thought Provoking Thursday. We got the uh, refuse bins to the curb early this morning because we forgot to put them out last night. And so we decided to sit out here a minute um, and uh, watch for some birds. We got some birds on the wire. Mainly, I turned on the video to take a look at this tree that is in front of uh, the front yard as well as the neighbor's front yard. That, that hedge right there is my neighbor's fence. And my neighbors have a beautiful, uh, large yard. But this tree uh, is displaying change. Look at that squirrel. Squirrel, you're going to get yourself hurt. Keep messing with them birds. Anyway, this tree has various shades of green and yellow green in its branches. <clears throat> on its branches. Reminding us to get our bodies and our minds and our spirit right for changes that have already begun and we need to adapt the birds are telling us the squirrels are telling us the trees and the plants are telling us we are just taking a breather while we, uh, before we uh, <clears throat> water the garden, and I've got some uh, cardboard to break down for the recycle bin, and I'm getting sick of all of this weed overgrowth amongst these bushes. I'm gonna see if I can do something about that, make it look a little bit tidy. I'm not gonna wait for the front yard to get terribly overgrown again. I'm gonna put in my request for uh, yard work uh, when it gets ankle high. <clears throat> when it gets uh, 12 inches or higher. But in the meantime, I'm gonna take my little garden fork and tidy up close to the building. It's a shame um, the lawn maintenance folk that have won the bids with this uh, homeowner this property management, the, uh, the amount must be so low that they cannot, uh, will not take pride in their work like they were doing last year. All of this would have been edged up. <clears throat> All of this would have been cut away. And now it's overgrowing because it's been uh, three, four weeks since the last edge up <laughs> since the last trim so the goddess takes care of those that take care of themselves so if I want this neatened up if I want this cleaned up I gotta do it myself and but you know eliminate some of the trip hazards in between the cracks of the walkway You don't look out for your loved ones. You can't count on others to do so. So that's my um, that's my um, early early a.m. meditations. Hopefully, we'll be able to bring uh, part two of the garden update. There were some transplants I left out. Um, the other day <clears throat> and um, we'll be working on the uh, the space underneath the sanctuary windows and trying to sow some uh, red mustard seeds again the uh, inadequate watering 
and we had a couple of uh, really hot days. It got over 90, and that just wilted the little uh, seedlings. So you know how we do. We gonna, we gonna, we've already reclaimed that soil, and we're going to start all over again. <laughs> Thank you to those that have made it this far, all the way to the end. Please give this video a like. Please share it with like-minded souls. And please book an online or an in-person meditation yoga class. I'm going to get in as many as I can before the frigid temperatures. Mm-hmm, yes indeed. <clears throat> and look at the sky. We're expecting look at there, look at there. We're expecting some storms later on this afternoon. Watch the birds. They'll tell you. Watch the clouds. They'll tell you. Look at the sky. Make your thought-provoking Thursday safe, make it healthy, and remember that you are already blessed in abundance. We just need to recognize that fact and act accordingly, act appropriately. Do something good for somebody. Do I ooh, many thanks. Much love to all and blessed be.